Have you ever, ever had chips dipped in iron brew? No, I don't know anybody that's had chips. Why would anybody dip chips in iron brew? Strange one. Are you a James Blunt fan? Um, not really, no. Uh, I don't really know enough of his, of his stuff. If I'd hear a song, I'd probably sing along it a little bit, but I wouldn't go out and buy it. Is that the same one as Billy Allen? Was that the same place? I can't remember. What is your favourite pre-match meal? Um, I've had the same pre-match for years and years. I have uh, toast and beans, a bit of grated cheese. But the toast has to be cut up, I'll cut it up too. It's probably a kid's version. It's probably a kid's version. 22 minutes, 25 seconds. Correct, correct. Would you ever play in Scottish football again? Um, never say never. Never say never. Um, the Scottish game has had its ups and downs, obviously with Rangers and stuff like that. But uh, no, you never know. What are you having for tea tonight? Um, I think we're having enchiladas. Maybe. Can I come? No. <laughs> <laughs> What's Fa the family sit there? <laughs> What's the favourite goal you've scored? What's your favourite goal you've scored for Callum? For Callum. Um, my favourite one for fans' reaction and dramatic scenes was probably had just one. Yeah. 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 It's got to be. Um, probably wasn't the best technically technical goal or anything like that, but. For the reaction after it was good. Favourite flavour of soup? Flavour of soup has to be. I like a thick minestrone. Italian thick minestrone. What's the best team you've ever played for? Um, <laughs> apart from Kaleo, <laughs> uh, it'd have to be for atmosphere and things. I think just because we went on the, uh, the European Cup run, it'd have to be out a massive, massive club and the fact that we've done a lot. I was there, I was great. This next one, I don't know if it was a girl or a boy who wrote in, do you fancy sleeping at my house for a movies and doodways night? Um, I don't think the kids and my girlfriend would appreciate that. That, that was a man that wrote that. <laughs> yeah, it was, was a man. That's an interesting, okay. What's your favourite goal you've scored in your career? My career uh, was when I was on loan at Hearts. Um, I scored a volley from outside the box, which I don't usually score goals from outside the box. Off the and take us. Well, Who do you get on You get that one, 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 um, myself and Norbs have got on the other end, but I try and go on everybody. And, yeah. You're not allowed to sit on the fence on this. Which of the younger players do you see having the brightest future in football? That's a tough one. It's then who said that. Alex Is that because he's in your position? No, I just think for natural ability and the poacher's ability, um, I call him, I literally call him prolific. Um, score goals for fun uh, in training and every game he's played in, I've seen him notch a goal. Good luck with this one. Which is the quickest route to get to Glen Eagles from Carlisle for the Ryder Cup next year? Um, <coughs> up to was up there in 74 and up there is it 80? I don't actually know, I don't know the names of the roads actually. <laughs> go towards Stirling and keep going. Towards <laughs> Perth, there you go. Happy days. Yeah. Did you enjoy standing in the Warwick with the Coventry fans? I did. The fans for the Coventry game? The fans, yeah, I did. Um, it gave me a, whole, a totally different perspective of the game. Obviously, it was a disappointing first half, and I don't think I'll ever be back in there because I'm not a good luck chum. <laughs> <laughs> but uh, it gave me another um, outlook on the game, to be honest. This is whether you know kids' jokes or not. Why is six scared of seven? That's <laughs> a pure joke. <laughs> <laughs> so, oh, right, oh, right. Oh. Do you like the Jaffa cakes? Do you like Jaffa cakes? Do you like Jaffa cakes? Do you like Jaffa cakes? Is that the full question? Yep. Yeah, I do like Jaffa cakes. Yeah, Jaffa cakes. Very refreshing. If you had to be a cow or a horse, which would you choose? A cow or a horse? A cow. A cow or a horse? Mm. Um, I think I'd be a horse. Right. Um, I just look a lot nicer than a cow, I think. <laughs> oh, here we go. Show us your favourite dance move. Are you sure you're ready for it? I don't know if, I don't know if you choose ready for it. <laughs> hot dogs or burgers? Uh, hot dog. Hot dog, yeah. Are you scared of cats? Do you know what? I don't really like cats, to be honest, but I wouldn't say I was scared of them. Which player has the best banter in the squad? 
None. There's no banner whatsoever <laughs> in there. It's hard to work with him, actually. Nobs is trying to take the title, is he not getting... Nobs has got some controversial banner. Um, oh, yes. Uh, apart from myself, um, I think I'll maybe go, I'll maybe go Nobs actually. He does try, he tries hard with his partner. What's your favourite Carlisle chant? Carlisle chant? Um, Rory Loy. <laughs> <laughs> Rory Loy. <laughs> and finally, if you could pick one player to join Carlisle United, who would it be and why? That's a oh, jeez, well, realistically. Mm -hmm. Realistically. Or on the other Gareth it. Bailey. Mm. Um, He's bigger than he looks on telly, isn't he? Uh, <laughs> I'm on this upslope here, aren't I? Oh god, that's a, that's a hard question, that. Um, can you bring them back if they have, if they have retired and that? I go on. Beckham, for me. What an answer. Ridiculous, ridiculous player. And just an um, all-round top guy, I think. I don't think there's a bad word that can be said with Beckham. I think he's class. Super, that's been Lee Miller. We'll be doing another Ask the Player soon. Keep an eye out on YouTube and on Twitter. Thank you very much. Thank you.